<laughs> okay, so let's point ahead, right? So, as I was saying, we have the value of u, the u dx, v, and the v dx, right? So, what we just need to do is to plug in these values into our formula, right? Okay, is that really difficult? No. So, that will give us. So instead of, let's say the y x is equal to, instead of u, what do we plug in? 2x two two x plus, 2x two x squared plus 1, right? 2x yes. squared plus 1, right? Okay. Times, instead of the v, the x, what do we plug in? 3. 3 times 3, right? Yes. Plus. Instead of v, what do we plug in? 3x plus 4, right? Yeah. Multiply by uh, the u dx. The u dx is what? 4x. 4x, right? Yeah. So at this point, what do we need to do? We clear the bracket, right? Yes. That is to say, we multiply 3 by the term in this bracket. The same thing to this next one, right? Yeah. So. When we multiply 3 by 2x squared, what do we have? 6x six six squared, square, right? Yes. And when we multiply it by 1, what do we have? 3. Okay? Yes. Plus. We do the same thing here again, right? Mm -hmm. We multiply 4x by the term which is in this bracket, right? Mm -hmm. So multiply 4x by 3x plus. So 4 times 3? 12. And x times x is what? x, x squared, square, right? Plus, 4x times 4 is what? 16x. 16 16x. At this point, what do we need to do? Connect. We connect like term, right? When we say like term, um, numbers that are the same or variables that are the same, we add them together, right? As you can see here, 6x squared and 20x squared are the same, right? So we add the coefficient, we call this one as the coefficient, we add our coefficient together, right? Yes. So what is the coefficient of x squared here? Is 6 or 10? Yes. Is 6 I mean? 6. So 6x squared plus 12x squared? 18x ah. squared. Square. Plus what? Plus 3 plus 16x plus 3. Plus 3. Plus 3. Yeah. So this is our final answer, right? Yeah. Okay? So you can copy this one.